beautiful people welcome back to the overwhelmed woman i'm emma and this video tags onto the video i did recently about purging your storage in order to declutter drastically or at least pretending imagining that you haven't got that storage and um, but this is on the premise that you have just been told that this time next week you've got to downsize to a property or an apartment that's half the size as the one you're in currently and you've only got a certain amount of time within that week obviously to try and downsize everything now if you are working or you're juggling childcare or family commitments if someone told you you would downsize into a house half the size in a week you would physically be struggling to find the time to sort through all your stuff so this is where the time element and the imaginary downsize really works as a game changer in clearing your clutter so say for example you've got four kitchen cabinets full of stuff set yourself a timer of say 10 minutes and and in that time go through all the stuff really quickly don't put the emotion in it because that's going to hold you up and you're going to procrastinate have you used it do you need it have you got duplicates get rid um, same with your wardrobe say someone says you've got to downsize to half a wardrobe this time next week say you've got six pairs of jeans might need to get rid of two or three may need to get rid of one of your long coats or one pair of boots if you've got two or three pairs you might need to halve the amount of games or teddies in a toy box because you've only gonna you're going you're only gonna have half the space next week and if you set yourself timers short time like maybe five minutes for every drawer or two you'll be amazed how much you play through because you haven't got the time to stop and procrastinate you have to do it you've got to because this time next week all your stuff is going to be outside on the pavement because there won't be enough room to get into your imaginary half-sized house so do that i promise you you will be amazed how quickly you tackle it and if you are really resident rest really reticent about doing it and the idea fills you with dread because you're thinking my goodness what if i put things away and i get rid of stuff and then realize i needed it if you have got the space to accommodate it bag it box it and put it out of sight leave it for a couple of months when you go back to it try and write down on a piece of paper what's in those bags i bet you you won't be able to and i bet you as well that you won't have missed any of the stuff in the bags and in the 15 years since i really started looking at my clutter properly um i've only ever missed one item that i got rid of and that was a set of wine glasses that sat in the back of my kitchen unit i never used them then one christmas ironically just after i decluttered them and got rid of them i realized i needed some wine glasses because we've got family and friends coming over and i went to the charity shop bought four for a pound used them all through christmas donated them back in january and released the space again that that the original set of wine glasses took up four years <laughs> and i promise you you'll be amazed how quickly the imaginary downsize linked with the stopwatch can work as a game changer in clearing your clutter and um, remember you know what stuff will never sustain you it will never make you happy it will just keep you trapped in so many ways and once you start to let it go everything becomes easier your housework being able to find stuff being able to get ready quick, quicker not spending money on crap you don't need because you forgot you've already got it because you'll be able to see that you've got it and you'll be able to access it easier and um, I promise you you'll never look back so anyway as always if you're overwhelmed remember you're not alone we're all overwhelmed together just doing the best we can we all deserve to lead a clutter free life physically and emotionally and um, I would love you to drop a like in the video subscribe to the channel and more importantly share it <laughs> and get all your friends on board as well because this overwhelmed woman needs all the help she can get and until next time massive love as always and now I'm going to get a cup of tea